Hello everybody, I want to show you with that video how to take a screenshot or a capture with Huawei P8 Lite in the version of 2017. So we need at first the power button, this is this one, and the volume down button, it is this one. Press it at the same time and you have a screenshot. One more time, power button and volume down button at the same time and you have a screenshot, you see it and you can hear it also. Um, after you are able also to share it or to edit it, uh, it's a nice tool. And there's a second way to take a screenshot. is uh, If you scroll down to the shortcuts, and if you then if it have you have it not visible, go on that arrow, and you have now the possibility to take a screenshot. One more time, the second way. Scroll down, go to the shortcuts, and then tap on screenshot. Yeah, as I told you, after you can uh, edit uh, the screenshot, let me show you how again. The most easiest way to take a screenshot is the button mode, the power button and volume down button. You have the screenshot, then you can go on edit directly, it's on the center. And um, there are some tools you have for one point, uh, you can paint a bit inside. Um, and uh, also the other thing is you can crop it. No? Um, the crop thing is very nice because you, if you have a website, maybe you can crop a picture um, or whatever you want to crop on your screenshot. Uh, it's a nice tool um, and you can just send this by WhatsApp or whatever. You know what I mean. So maybe let us uh, crop here the Google bar. You just adjust with the, with the navigation here. And uh, yeah. Is I grab it now. Then I go on save. If I go on the disk, and the screenshot is saved. Okay, where to find the screenshots? Uh, the screenshots are at the gallery, and you see I have already many tries, and this is my Google toolbar. If you want to edit the screenshot after, um, you can do it also. Uh, at the pictures, so just use choose the screenshot or the picture. You can do this with the picture, what I show you now, and you can go and edit. And now you can also edit it again, paint a bit inside, or crop it. Let us crop it. Go and crop. Let us take the Google bar example again, then confirm here and save again if you go on the disk. Now the screenshot. Is saved. Go back, go back a second time, and now you have the other toolbar. I hope I could help you with this video and answer your question. And uh, if you want, you can leave me a comment or give me some thumbs up. It's very, very helpful. Thank you so, so much. And um, yeah, maybe until next time. Ciao.